Hey guys, it's Wendy here with Wendy's Plans and today I am going to be filming a viewer or subscriber request and guys, I'm going to show you how I print out book covers using my Canon Ivy printer. So guys, stick around. guys so I'm not going to say that this is the only way or the best way to print your photo your book covers on the Ivy print now I'm going to show you how I do it so I go into Goodreads I haven't downloaded the app so It'll be okay. So then I pick out a book and let's see, Divine Rivals. I think that's what we will. Um, there we go. And then it's going to pull up. I'm going to turn on my printer so that everything will be where it needs to be okay so <clears throat> got ahead of myself guys but I know I'm, I need that to be on okay so let's say I want to print out this book cover I am going to bring the book cover up for my phone, I press the volume control and the off button, and it saves that book to my downloads, okay? Now, I have done that for four other books that I'm going to print. So, I open my Canon, let me show you where that is. I go to my mini print, which is the app for the IV Canon. I am going to go down until I find the four equal spaces. And then I'm going to do select the four book covers that I want. And what I'm going to do is then I'm going to go into that space. And I'm going to fill that space with the book. Okay. And I am doing that by just moving the book cover there we go on to so now I have all four book covers that I want. I like to have them neat in the middle, and I don't know why I can't get that one, but it'll be okay. So, we've got all the four book covers on those four spots. So, now we're going to go up here and hit print. And I'm looking for my little scissors. And I can't find them, so we'll get my big scissors out.
and then you get all four book covers on one sticker page. And then I go in and I cut the four books apart. And now I have four book covers. Guys, it's, it's just that easy. Um, you, once everybody's phone is different. Mine is an Android phone. It is not an iPhone. So for me, when I download them, they go into my downloads and my mini print will pull um, the photos from those options. So it, it really is going to pull from anything that um, is, is, is there. I, I don't know other than it's it's pulling from my photos and my documents not documents but downloads and so if you pick the four it is going to do a size that is about an inch and a half long by an inch wide um, you do have other options I've never printed um, any smaller than that um, I'm looking for an option to do Um, let's see if we can do three sets of twos. Like this book, one more row. Yeah, we could do that. I don't know how well two, three, four, five. looking for some more book covers. We'll go back to Goodreads, Scott. I need two more book covers. Um, Oh, maybe it's the inheritance. It's just inheritance. <laughs> there we go. So we'll do this one. And let's see, I could do six of crows. Because that is another book that I have read this year. Okay, so now let's go back to our Everything's running so slow. Um, let's go back to our mini print. Okay, so let me put it flat. We're going to go back to our mini print. I didn't fully charge it. So hopefully we'll have enough to this through. 
Okay, we just picked six. So, see, I feel like these are going to be too small because it's hard to. Even when you let it auto size itself. Maybe that's the way. It just doesn't get the whole book. I think if you go, I, 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 we're going to print them out and we'll see. But I just don't feel like you, you're not going to get the whole book cover is the way I feel. Because once you, come on book, once you make the book bigger, it will auto lock into the size. So it's not really going to give you the whole book cover is what I'm trying to say. I would not go that small because you're not going to get the whole book cover. I think um, the best way is going to be um to do the four I, I i just don't think you can get the whole book in there maybe if i didn't expand it when i go to goodreads and just d do a screenshot of that without expanding it but before i do that it may would fit i'm just saying i think it's going to be very small i don't think you're going to be able to get as much detail and everything that you want to get from the book. That's my opinion. But guys, you have so many options in um, the different um, settings. I'm trying to see if there's something else that would work. I mean, you could possibly... Let's do Inheritance, Identity, and Iron Flame. And I know I can rotate. There we go. You could possibly do that way. I don't, I don't, without playing around with it more, this one doesn't lock it into place. Um, so I don't think that one's going to work either, not as well. Um, for my experience, I will say I, this is the one that I like, the one where you do four. It, it's, to me, it's just a really good size. And um, you, it, it's just easy. And what, like I said, once you spread it out and you click it in the middle, it kind of snaps it to those boundaries. So I hope, guys, that this was um, helpful for you. 
and um, sometimes I even go on Amazon. Let's try that. Um, let's go down and let me go to, and let's put, pull up fourth wing. Like if I want to do fourth wing, I don't want it to pull up my audible. You, you need one that's forward facing and not on a tilt. Let's just do this one. So like this one, you can double tap it and make it big. Oh, that's just... Let's just pick out some books. I don't know why I'm being so picky. Okay, Wendy, just let's just do it. Oops, too quick, too quick. Okay, so now we have four photos from Amazon. Let's see if there's much of a difference. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to be able to use this one, but we'll see. I still think it's easier to do from well I, well this is this one's not doing too bad now that okay let's try this one and see what it does now we're out of paper <laughs> and I think I still have some But you can just go to any screen that has the book cover on it is basically what I'm saying. And um, just go ahead and screenshot it. That's That has been what I have done. Um, it's coming out toward me. And then once you go into the app, it's pretty much going to walk you through the process. But guys, I, for demonstration purposes, I've really taken 
not taking very long to try to center or make this as, as good as it could be. But there again, you know, I've got all the books info on there. And so then you could just go in here and separate the books. there you go oops so you really could take them from um any from what i'm looking at here you can take them from amazon also um, and then once you do that then the back will peel off and then you've got a sticker and you can just stick that down in your book. So I hope this was um, helpful. I, if you have any questions, just leave me a message down below and I will be glad to answer as many questions as I can. It's pretty easy. Um, like I said, I figured this process out on my own and I'm not saying it is the best way. I'm not saying it's the easiest way. I'm not saying it's the right way. It's just the way that I have been doing it. And that's, it's just an easy way for me. So guys, if you've gotten this far in this video, leave me a book down below. <laughs> See if there's an icon or an emoji that has a book. And leave that down below. And guys, thank you so much for the support of my channel. If you're new, hit that subscribe button. Um, hit the bell for notifications. Give me a thumbs up. And um, if you've been watching my videos but you've never subscribed, please subscribe. And until next time, guys, bye-bye.